See, I used to think that, you know, if you're in a shelter, you had to have brought it on yourself, you know, drugs or booze or, but no, things happen. I, right now I'm taking a computer course on Thursday nights, which is very helpful because I am computer stupid. I <laughs> didn't turn it in on. That's about all I know. Right click. We're going to get fancy on you. Wait for it to do its thing. Okay, and what you want to do is go down to insert, about a third of the way down that menu. Yep. And we just want to shift cells down. Click OK. You were homeless then this year? Yes. Was that the first time you were homeless? No. Okay. Ten years ago, I uh, stayed at the uh, Southside Mission. I was raising my grandson and we stayed there. Then my roommate passed away and his family, you know, wanted the house back. And, and it was rather sudden. What happened this time? Uh, I was staying with a friend and it just, personalities clashed and it just, and I didn't want to go stay with my daughter again so I just, I tried the emergency shelter and it worked out. It's been a real blessing. The program lasts until we transition her into permanent housing and into a permanent job. I've been doing the desk since August as a volunteer. So that's helped me because I've never done uh, jobs like that before. We want her to not only get just the basic skills of answering the phone reception, we want her to get the, the networking down. You know, we want her to get um, the work ethic down, all that. There's more to it. What is this Thanksgiving like? in terms of in here, or in here, compared to maybe before? Having a safe place to live, uh, knowing that, that the people here are looking out for my best interest, trying to help me, and just knowing that, you know, that they were here. And if not, I don't know what I would have done. Now that's the question I ask. Where would I have gone if this place wasn't open? Then I probably would have truly been on gotcha. the <laughs> We gotcha. <laughs> All right.